Lion Shark must so often... I mean, I'm not an ornithologist, but I think it's probably a bad idea to get in the middle of the natural migration cycles. Just saying. Put down the Shark attack too often provokes Port Clovis locals into killing every swimming creature along the coast. <laughs> the bartender life in Bobby Bojang. are getting heated in this war of attrition between man and nature. Humans' attention spans are short. They've already forgotten about the shark and her many crimes, so this ends the battle. The shark returns to the grotto to focus on personal transformation.
needle tooth nightmare, the Barracuda. Most recognize it as the title of a classic rock radio staple. Did you know that it's also a fish? Well, it's true. Back on board the Cajun Queen. That's Kyle, my son. He's just here for the summer. Studies marine biology. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. I got one hand can still tie a hook. He got two can barely tie his shoes. <laughs> Must get that from his mama. Used to help my daddy around. Spent a lot of time together. But we wasn't close. He was a shark hunter. That's all he was. If anybody were gonna catch the mega, it'd be him. <laughs> Thought it was a government experiment, got himself loose. Boy, he wanted that shark. Wanted it bad. Found it once. Didn't catch it, no. What... what happened to your father? Huh? What happened? Look, uh... I ain't got time to answer questions all day. Got work to do.
Just like Kyle LeBlanc, our young bull is the inheritor of a long family tradition, struggling to find her place in the world. Golden Shores was built as vacation residences for wealthy out-of-towners, with spectacular ocean views, private beach access, and a gate to keep out the locals.
whale shark demonstrates the importance of getting enough minerals in her diet. is an animal of broad dietary proclivities. of the grotto enables the shark to approach the world with greater confidence and effectiveness. The rover is always swimming, searching for anything to satisfy the gluttony that is their defining trait. Consistently the most difficult hole on the course, many golfers struggle with this par 7 humdinger. This instantized protein makes a great between-meal supplement, giving the shark the energy she needs to put on serious mass.
Makers often swim in a figure eight pattern prior to an attack. Sharks can locate prey from great distances using both smell and sound. They may occasionally team up with other bull sharks to outwit them. Golden Shores import this mako from Sri Lanka and train it to guard their community? Not likely, but let's pretend they did, as it makes for a more interesting story. Mako's are highly migratory, with the ability to travel across entire oceans. Why this one would willingly stay in Port Clovis is beyond me. was more likely to be killed by a falling coconut. It took weeks for our crew to earn the shark hunters' trust, to convince them we were not insurance investigators questioning their disability claims. Serious problems on Golden Shores. Need personal response. Dad.
Most shark hunters have close friends or family members who have been eaten or half eaten by sharks. Shark fin traders come every year to Baton Tordu. Because what other way is there to celebrate killing beautiful animals to taste as nutritional as body parts than a $450 round of golf? constantly reminded of how man's intrusion has disrupted the fragile equilibrium of the marine world. Probably spend less, save more, and start researching indexed mutual funds.
hunters may occasionally drink on the job, they know actually that's pretty irresponsible. Savage Shrimper, Pookie Paul. Got her! as the situation further escalates. Flamingo Joe. has forgotten all about its rogue shark for now. The sea wolf remains acutely aware of anything that might constitute food.
Vintage in 23 is certainly heating up the evolutionary arms race. Shark attacks occur with surprising frequency, yet little or no apparent regularity. aspect of the shark's brain makes them almost incapable. It's remarkable how quickly Port Clovis takes up arms. These big people bodies always end in fight for the Who are we carry to make sure they are Make them ready. Right. Anybody 
just see that. Well, we did the best we could do. Another shark hunt draws to a close. Somebody's drinking team has a drowning problem. found in a shark's stomach, it's truly the ocean's garbage can. This mineral supplement wouldn't be necessary if this shark ate a more nutritious, well-balanced diet. It's like a thousand cans of condensed tomato soup. Encounters such as this are quick and impersonal things. Hunger is a driving force for the bullshit. Anyone who has delved into the stomach contents of a shark is acutely aware that they'll eat just about anything.
This protein supplement has zero additives, so the shark doesn't have to worry about hidden artificial colors or flavors. Hockey sticks are still legal according to Baton Tordu course rules, but not for long if membership director Doug Thompson has anything to say about it. is an exciting and growing field where you can risk alligators and venomous snakes for seven to 10 cents per ball. These scavengers of the sea are vital in cleaning the ocean floors of edible and semi-edible detritus. The members of Baton Tordu who commissioned this piece apparently found it whimsical. Whereas if you ask me, it's a little trite and unimaginative. 